All of these hair care companies say that their products are for our hair. That's nonsense. Today, I'm going to show you what the best products to use are. My name is Waveman J. I turn beginner waivers into elite waivers. You're clearly interested in that. So scroll down, like the video, and subscribe to get elite waves. My hair used to be plagued with dandruff and dry scalp because I trusted products like Cantu and many store-bought shampoos. You're literally going to start to see people who use these products go bald in the next 10 years. Look at it, OGX, a popular shampoo brand that many people use, many waivers used to use around two years ago, they got sued for hair loss just last year. They say on the box that they're all natural and keep your hair moisturized for days. It's not a box, bro, it's a bottle. <laughs> they say on the bottle that they're all natural and keep your hair moisturized for days and enhances your natural curls. That's nonsense. If anything, these products have kept my hair dry and addicted to using them because you have to use the products every single day so your hair doesn't dry out. And when you use products every single day, waivers know this as product buildup, which is very bad for you. Product buildup makes your hair stink. It creates dandruff and dry scalp in your hair as well. When I use any products in the wave community, it hurts me to think that I've been treating my hair like this for so long without even knowing and just holding back the full potential of my curl pattern. It hurts me to think that this is the very thing that hinders many wavers from reaching their full potential and keeping their hair texture dry, dull, and mediocre. Over the last several months, ever since I switched out these products I can to for all natural products, my hair literally went from looking like this to looking like this. And I'm gonna show you how you can make that change as well. So to be able to do this too, first you need to throw away completely every piece of knowledge you know about moisturizing your hair. This is what I have to do. This is what you have to do because it's probably so indoctrinated in your hair. <laughs> it's probably so indoctrinated in your head what works for moisturizing hair. Just throw it all away, all of it is false. The perfect hair diet consists of three things. It adds moisture to your hair. It keeps that moisture sealed in your hair and it makes your hair look healthy and shiny in result of these two things. If you find products that have all three of these things, you'll have flawless waves. Let's break this down. Adding moisture to your head is done by using water or a water-based product. The reason why you don't want to be using water, however, is because adding water to your hair causes waivers to overcurl and that's a terrible thing to happen to your waves. So you want to be using a water-based product instead. Water-based products consist of using leave-in conditioners, creams, etc. Usually on this bottle, the first thing it says is like agua or water. You only want to be using a tiny bit of leave-in because they're quite... <sighs> I need to yawn or something. <gasps> you just yawn too. <laughs> you only want to be using a tiny bit of leave-in conditioner, however, because it is a very water-based product. However, using something like a cream is a lot more thick. Which one should you get? It really just depends on the occasion. I do recommend you get both, but you want to get both because you want to be able to learn your hair type. Next, we want our hair to be sealed, which allows our hair to be moisturized around the clock. So in order to accomplish this, we want to use something that seals in the moisture. As you should know, water and oil do not mix. So oil going above water will in theory maintain the moisture inside your hair. So you wanna be using butters, pomades, and oil, but make sure not to confuse penetrative oils with sealant oils because one of these help aid in your hair moisturizing. The other one, however, seals in the moisture. If you've ever seen an oil spill, in the middle of the ocean and the oil is sitting on top of the water, this is the effect you wanna recreate on your hair. Doesn't mean you go ahead and put an entire jar of Murray's on your head. I'm just saying, you wanna be able to just get a little bit of dime size to be able to spread throughout your head and seal in the moisture. Putting oil or sealant in your hair isn't a good enough to be able to have your hair moisturize along the clock because eventually that's just gonna dissipate into the air and evaporate and then boom, your hair is dry again. So what you wanna be doing is keeping the moisture locked in, additionally using a silky do-rag or like a silk thing on your hair, Pref preferably a do-rag because it actually wraps around your head. But I know there's like silk line beanies that Juice has, 
but you want to be using like a do-rag, a soak do-rag. If you use a cotton do-rag, it'll take all the moisture out. You want to make sure you use a soak do-rag. And I'm not talking about the silk and like velvet do-rags. I mean a do-rag such as this one, you know, where it's nice and silky. This is just a wave cap. You see this wave cap, you don't even want to be putting this wave cap on your head ever because it's still going to dry out your hair because it's not silky. You want to be using silky do-rags only. Lastly, making your hair look overall shiny and healthy starts with just improving upon your hair health. This is a long-term thing. If you start to implement the things I've told you previously, you should know. Lastly, making your hair look shiny and overall healthy starts with providing your hair the proper nutrient to be and look healthy. So using penetrative oils and butters will do the job. All right, I understand you're telling me to do all this hair help, blah, blah, blah. So just tell me, you know, the people want to know what products do we use? Yeah, bro, come on, wave man, bro. Just tell me what products to buy. Take my money, please. Okay, okay, okay. I just want to make sure this is clear. Products do not get your waves. They only enhance it. And a general rule of thumb when getting products, you don't want to be using, you know, a lot of store-bought products. But if they are store-bought, make sure they're from like brands like As I Am which have nice and healthy products that are just natural. Make sure those products are natural. That's why a bunch of waivers always recommend a lot of black owned businesses products because they're always natural and designed for our hair texture. But now I will show you the products I recommend you use. And now lastly, what you all have been waiting for eagerly and patiently, so I appreciate that. The products, these are products that I've gathered across my year of waving and what i recommend you use and you know they're mostly healthy and natural and good for you so first here we have this 216 wavy butter moisturizer i do have a promo code for this and i have a, this is my extra one i don't know i might give this one away but yeah i like this because it's a butter and a moisturizer so it kind of gets rid of like two problems at once but if you've heard of the loc method i think it's more of a c honestly it smells great Man, I want to eat it, bro. Bro, I, I'm going to try not to eat it and give myself ligma. But yeah, I do recommend it, but I want to only have this. I recommend you have at least leave-in conditioner. This pair is great with leave-in conditioners. Only put a tiny bit, though. So going on to the leave-in conditioner, this smells great, too. I got this last year around Christmas time. It's a nice, you know jamaican black castor oil that's a really good oil for your waves it's from as i am this you can buy this in stores from as i am and it's a very it's very good to use i do recommend getting this this is like this is natural to what i know as natural as a sore butt product can be i do actually recommend this and similar to that this is a very this at least used to be a kind of popular in the wave community this as i am double buttercream so you know what a butter is but this is a double buttercream so it's a cream. So technically it is a sealant, but it is a water-based product. It's like butter turned like twice or something. So it is pretty water in texture. The main ingredient is water. So I want to use this as a butter because you can't, but it is kind of similar to this in a way, but this is more of a butter. A sealant moisturizer. It sounds similar to this, but this has more, you know, butter properties in this. So next, as we've been mentioning butter a lot, here are my butters. So I have two examples here. One buy a waiver i do recommend you get this it smells great i almost ate it a few times link in the description is an instagram and boom you see the ingredients that's how you know it's a natural product that's why we promote you know black owned businesses you know they know what's best for us i've been digging in this as you can see it smells great this is like a heavy duty butter kind of like a regular butter this is a real butter you want to be using these butters last. I actually do recommend this. I use this quite a bit. And then I have an example of the butter I used to use. I kind of stopped using this once I got this. It smells not that great. I don't even know where I got this from. I, I got it from my grandma's house. I stole this from my grandma. I think I should give it back now. Next, we need to get to our oil. So we have a penetrative oil and a sealant oil. For this penetrative oil, so you typically hair grow oils. This is a nice Susa Skin Wavy hair grow oil. I recommend this. It smells like cinnamon. And then there's this. Bro, this is popular in the wave space. I did spill like half of it on my floor and it took weeks to clean up. But yeah, this is a heavy duty, heavy duty oil. Really, this is a real man sealant oil. Everybody should be owning a sealant oil. Don't be like a lot of people and only have a penetrative oil. That was me for a long time. I didn't understand the differences. But yeah, you want to make sure you have a sealant oil as well. So these are all the products I recommend. 
Yeah, I can show them a little bit. But yeah, if you want any of these products I showed in the video, the link in the description. And if you want to know how you can actually effectively use these products to moisturize your hair, watch these videos right here. Thanks for watching. God bless. Ah.